getting general messages for you for today so let's get started so we're going to be taking a look at the current energy or just how you're feeling currently the first card so talking about investments or something that you possess having to do with money holding on to what you possess holding on to something that's valuable and as if there may be a flood coming and you need to just hold on to what's yours so that it, it does not wash away security financial security holding on securing your money or securing your investments that's what we've been talking about money and investing or someone might find you valuable and worthy of being held on to so let's see the jack of hearts so this, either this is you, Cancer, Water Sign, Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio, or this is someone that we see coming around that wants to maybe invest in you, or this is you investing in yourself. See that? But someone may want to say something to you or give something to you. Could be love. Maybe someone wants to hold you. They feel like you're valuable and they want to possess you. Honestly, when I was shuffling just now, I feel like someone is on their way to you. It's the energy of, I felt like I went to that person walking now. Like they're hurrying to get to you. That their intention is to get to you now. So we're going to take a look at the other card. Which influences this card. is the two. So it's dream again for me the two of wands is dream again if someone is dreaming again or they're sharing a dream with you or someone is following their heart the two of wands so some some something is align, aligning for you maybe in business or a message that you're getting or feelings or it could be aligning with a fire sign or a water sign at home in business as if someone will be coming to to your space to talk about money with you or, or something about business or to share this dream when i say it's dream again i feel like it's after someone has moved on from a marriage that they've been in for a long time you know and they decide you know i'm gonna try i'm gonna get married again that's the dream again energy or you've been running a business for a long time and it's you know you've been maybe retired but now you want to start something over that's dream again energy then what is influencing you dreaming again or this business alignment that's coming around for you or not business alignment maybe aligning with your gift gift and inheritance land because with fertility like i say planting earth reproduction all of that is the one's energy fire passion desire rebirth energy dreaming again maybe some of you have discovered your gifts and you're dreaming once more so let's see what influences that the queen of visions oh my god you have huge big, big dreams when i see the queen of pentacles i'm talking about financial independence and liberation here like freedom from being in a, an energy where you have to be going hard it's just on that cycle of working and then paying your bills just to pay your bills working just to pay your bills i feel like you want to be out of the clear of that completely which i feel i want that for every single human being because it is only insanity to live otherwise i want that for everyone that freedom that's why you're dreaming again so we're going to take a look at what's coming next so this is influencing investments and all of that i do feel like you have the potential like i say i feel like you're aligning with what is naturally yours a gift so maybe the ace of wands is a gift that you have or a new idea or a new business or something that's gonna take you into this financial independence and stability if it's not finances that you're worrying about it's a feeling clearing up in you it's well-being it's it's being on the top of your game some of you are good with money some of you could be financial at financial advisors some of you could be good at investing i feel so free out here um so you know look into that i feel like it is your calling so if you feel like you're meant to be wealthy or you're not supposed to be struggling with bills and so on and so forth i feel like there's a way for you to not do that and that could be investing and i feel honestly something about real estate investment or home or something that's going to help you to feel stable the highest you can come to in the situation here 
for the six of swords movement shift making a decision to move or to act it's like you're getting some information and you're deciding to take action on it and we're going to see where that's going to lead you six of swords for me it's just I like being on it's like being on a straight stream a flow like I say someone could be moving or you could be deciding to move your money and invest it somewhere else are you moving into that investment are you moving away from somewhere and all right so let us see what the outcome will be the outcome is how you feel now this is how this spread is designed now that you have this information how are you feeling currently or what can you do in relation to this message that you're receiving five of hearts i feel like some people are still going to be uncertain unsure because you still have ways of old with you like old emotions the ways how your parents used to treat money or investments or your belief in certain things or so yeah 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 so now you have the choice that is what the five of heart is saying now you have the information will you move forward because the five of hearts is also kind of inheritance taking up what you've had what, what you have and something that really really belongs to you the two of hearts you know taking up what you have and moving forward will you choose to do that or will you stay where you currently are at now that you have this information the five of hearts is saying will you continue looking at what you've lost what you've learned especially having to do with your emotions and your family or Will you make the move forward to become what you've always dreamt of or wanted, which is this freedom? And I think you should be bringing this for others, not just yourself, this financial freedom. It's not just for you. It's for many others. It's not just for you. You know, because someone says, if you feel different in the world, it could be that you're here to create a new world. So don't hold back on yourself. Don't feel like you're thinking too big or you're dreaming too big. No, no no don't stay small don't stay stuck don't let because this is what you see or the norm of your family and your environment cause you to want to stay stuck dream again that's the message and it's coming from a place of love too vibration i feel like you still feel indecisive or maybe you do move forward because we have the sixth and the seventh so maybe you start planning and taking action maybe you start looking more into investments Maybe you start asking questions. Maybe you start looking up, researching, stuff like that with the Seven of Swords. But some of you maybe are still in denial or you're still doubting that it could be true. Because the Seven of Wands, Seven of Swords feels like doubt to me at times. Like mental blocks. Like, nah, -uh, that can't be so. Nah, like, no way. You know, like stubborn. Can't be stubborn. It's something that you're planning. Maybe you're planning on invest investment, stability in finances. It's money that's yours. Maybe you have a business or some service that you offer. It's very, very stable for you now. CMOS heals the body by removing harmful chemicals that are caused by some foods we eat, hormones, toxic substances, and radiation from 5G from our devices. Heal your temple with the minerals of infinite oceans. CMOS has over 90 of the 102 nutrients our body needs, like copper, which creates balance and harmony. To learn more about CMOS health benefits or to order your first premium grade CMOS, email italkitchenstyle at gmail.com. Maybe others can learn from you. Maybe you can share some information. Maybe you do something that has to do with truth telling or death, perhaps. And I feel like you feel hopeful when I see this, Jack. I feel I'm reading for someone specific now. When you're seeing this, it makes you feel hopeful. You're smiling. Because it makes you feel like at least like you have work to do. 
you know, like there's something for you to look forward to investing, invest your time and your energy in, to put into building something. And it's good for your, your mind because I feel someone's mind is becoming more clear with the seven of swords energy as well. Because when you make this shift, take this action from this message, it's clear, it's making you clear up certain things you know why because you're moving past some emotional things that weren't good for you like you're gonna be focused more driven more direct i feel like you're gonna know exactly what you're doing planning organized you know i feel like you're gonna wake up every day happy because you feel like all right you feel like and i feel like you have family around you that you feel good about waking up and maybe going to work or doing what it is that you do building Something that you've prayed for hoped for i can't explain it fully but it feels like you know you went through a lot or you've been going through something but this feels like hope you know what i mean it feels like something is about to shift for you possibly today and it's um it's so it's almost like it it happens this fast like you're here crying and then someone comes in and gives you some good news and you stop crying that's how i feel and it's about something that you've always wanted like they're telling you money is here and you're like Mom. but it's good it's real it's very very real like someone is knocking you're crying and then someone may be knocking at your door and the news that they're giving to you is good it's like your energy immediately changes and you start you feel good like something you've always wanted especially your fears could be you're, you're not gonna have this home you're not gonna make it across this finish line you're not gonna align with this passion and this design this new dream that you have remember we're talking about dreaming again sometimes you have to get out of your comfort zone and you have to use, even use your words and your faith to accomplish what you want instead of the, allowing the environment to dictate to you what you get i feel like it is okay for you to say like if i deserve it this is what I want. Words for me also speaks of praying and determination, having such a steadfast connection to your feet. You know, even to the tough times, like someone really going through it and just praying and praying and praying, and then, like I say, something you get something that re like your prayers are answered. Someone knocks at your door, with the information that you've wanted. Something about your home today. Let's see what the outcome is for you. The three of hearts. That's so beautiful. Your day is going to be good. Like I already feel it. Successes. Communication. Community. Coming together. The ace of love. Something that you do out of love. And then aligning with love. And then what you're doing is of love. So you're successes. Successing. Celebrating. Love. This is also a card of marriage. Some of you could be celebrating marriage. Because remember someone wanted to dream again with you. Maybe this could be a person of your past that you had a child with. This person could be earth sign or water sign. Or there could be an air sign coming around to you. You could be moving toward a water sign or moving away from a water sign. But the outcome is amazing. We have the three of hearts here when it comes to your hopes. And your fears, your hopes, your fears about your home or your living situation, you're going to be successful in it with the three of hearts. You're going to celebrate. And you're going to love it. You're going to love it. You're going to be celebrating lo with loved ones. So thank you for watching. Um, I do really appreciate you being here. I appreciate all of the support that you show to this channel. I love you so much. I will see you in the next reading. Until then, remember that you can be, do, have everything and anything in this world that you desire because you're all so dream big all is within you take care bye